It's Andrew here for Just For Last Trivia every Tuesday night at your Green Bank. Do you know that there's a whole new menu here at Eats on Anzac? So there's specials on the weeknights, but there's also a lunch deal, a $10 lunch deal, which is fantastic. But on Tuesday nights, when Trivia is on, they do a special menu, which is two for Tuesday. So you can come in here, uh, have a bite to eat, and then come along to uh, Trivia a bit later on, and you get two for Tuesday on your menu. I'm just like, there's some great stuff on here, I'll tell you what. But anyway, so you come in here and eat, then come along into the lounge where we're doing trivia. It starts at seven o'clock, absolutely free to play, goes for about an hour and a half, some absolutely fantastic prizes to be won. So look, there's prizes for winning, but for just turning up, you go into the barrel drawer for $100 cash, or maybe one of the vouchers that we give away. You don't even have to score any points and still win $100, but you're going to score points. You know why? because I have three questions to give you in advance. So are you ready for this? This week's questions include, number one, what word beginning with an S is a type of sailing vessel, and that's the hard part, but gets easier, and also a type of beer glass? Mm-hmm, I know. I don't think we had them in Queensland for a while, but anyway, let's move on. Uh, second one, in which country was food writer and celebrity cook Nigella Lawson born? Hmm. And finally, uh, what 1978 winner of the Melbourne Cup's name is the reverse spelling of the New South Wales town where one of his owners lived? It's a long-winded way of saying who won the 1978 Melbourne Cup. So all of these questions, you can look them up in advance and bring the answers with you and you'll have them there for when I read them out. We go for about an hour and a half, 7 to 8.30. We're trying to have a lot of fun. Hopefully we will see you there. And don't forget, Come along to Eats on Anzac and grab yourself two for Tuesday before you play. Mm.